for years, right here along the water, Barberton has created this beautiful piece of art. And this year's theme is patriotic and quite colorful, just like one of their volunteers. I like the red and the yellow. Oh my goodness. In the middle of downtown Barberton, color. We can uh, space it out a little bit more. And moms aren't lacking. We're going to have th three, three across. Neither are volunteers. Tell her the truth, Blandy. How old are you? I'm 93. 93? Whether I like it or not. <laughs> It goes down with the other red ones. Laddie Davis is one of dozens of volunteers yeah. that have been helping put together the festival for years. Well, it keeps me from drinking too much beer. He's a career veteran that served 23 years in the Army, but now moms fill up his time. I got the mom plant, but no flowers. Well, that's not the way to live. But that's the way the flowers grow. Mum fest is this weekend. The festival has been going on since the late 1900s. It was held every year since 1987. It was originally to celebrate the anniversary of the city. Bob Hum volunteers with the organizing committee telling News 5 they spend 365 days planning for this one weekend. When do you start the planning? Next week. <laughs> During the festival, they offer a list of things. You're going to see entertainment, shops along the avenue over here that will sell different items. And of course, this will be with the first variety that sells out. Lots of mums. This year it's 12,600 actually. They aren't just randomly placed. It's wonderful. Beautiful. During that planning, they come up with a theme. The theme this year is red, white, and blue. One foot centers, 12 by 12. Then a design. So he has to grid it out, and that's how he comes out with the, where to plant things. And finally, 15 different varieties. You have the masterpiece. Wow, is this what the Garden of Eden is gonna look like? Let's hope. Made from nothing but mums. So this picture is that field. It is. It takes time, thousands of mums and lots of volunteers. The design to the grid, to the planting, to this. But they make it happen every year. It does them well, it, it serves them well. They, they do a good job for a little city. So make sure you check out the festival and... So what advice would you give to everybody that's gonna come out here for Mum Fest? Buy mums, good for the fest. So if you wanna get a glimpse of all those colorful mums, you got two opportunities, Saturday and Sunday, right here in the middle of downtown Barberton. Reporting in Barberton, Adina Busada, News 5.